Hello everybody, I'm Nasty Mold, and in this video we are going to go over our upcoming traveling spirit for this week. This spirit should be arriving on Thursday, and it is the Spinning Mentor. We have had this spirit before, and they bring some pretty cool cosmetics in my opinion. They have this quail looking mask, this hairstyle, and this pretty neat cape. It's been a while since we've seen these spirits, so it's kind of nice that they come back again, and it's kind of nice that it's a repeat given all of the uh, instrument spirits we currently have visiting with the Days of Music. You don't have to spend your candles if you don't need to. But we can find the spirit in the Village of Dreams. Let's head there and relive them. We're basically going to head all the way down the hill and head towards where we can find the Dreams Guide. So just on the right hand side of this area. Don't fall in a fishing hole. And they're just past the guide behind this building here. Kind of tucked in, kind of hidden. All in all, it's a very easy spirit to relive, like most of these ones are. We just have to follow it and skate around with it for a little while. And now with the spirit completed, let's check out the upgraded emotes it'll bring. The spirit brings the spin emote, as you can tell by their name, the spinning mentor. Here's the level 2 version. Level 3 And finally level 4 For a closer look at the cosmetics, the spirit brings this funky looking mask. It's got this little dangle in the front. I suppose it's meant to be some sort of a bird feather. The bloom here is a little atrocious. It's crazy. So you can see there's some gold eyelash accents, some red, some dark on the face. Now for the rest of the cosmetics, I actually really, really like them. This is their hairstyle and it's very sleek. Uh, you can see it's tied up in three separate places, and in each of these little tied up sections, you can actually see through. There's little holes. I think that's pretty neat. All in all, it's a very neat and tidy hairstyle, but you can see there's one piece in the back that's out of place in the, I guess, ponytail or whatever piece that is. I like this one a lot. And then finally, this fluffy, fluffy looking cape. I enjoy this one so much as well, and it matches with a lot of cosmetics because we have a ton of red cosmetics in this game. Super fluffy, super soft looking. I love the detail of the feathers that are poking out. They kind of fade to a white. It adds a lot more depth and makes this cape a little more unique than just being kind of fluffy. It also has a cool shape. It's kind of reminiscent of the uh, gratitude capes for me, just the shape of it, which I enjoy. And the interior, let me just lift up my arm. It's just fluffy and dark to match that fluff color. 
And finally for the spirit's pricing. Now this is the pricing that we had last time it visited, so it's probably accurate, but I will still say estimated pricing, things may change. Um, we're looking at the level one spin emote being three, of course. Level two version being four hearts. We have a blessing for five candles. Connect to that, we have the hairstyle for 44 and a heart for three. Above that, we have a permanent wing buff for two ascended candles. Then we have the level three spin emote for three hearts. Level four spin emote for six hearts. We have the mask for 42 candles. And at the very top, we have one more blessing for five candles and the fuzzy fuzzy cape for 70. So we are looking at an estimated total of about 13 hearts, 169 candles, and two ascended candles. So this is a pretty pricey spirit, but not the priciest we have seen. I also feel like some of these cosmetics are slightly skippable. Like for me, if I didn't have the candles, I'd probably skip the mask. It's something that I don't think I've ever worn. Um, but also remember we do have those extra returning spirits in the Harmony Hall right now with the Days of Music. So be sure to save candles uh, and spend them on those if you'd rather have those cosmetics that they bring. And yeah, just like that, that is everything I have to share on the Spinning Mentor. Thank you guys so much as always for stopping in. I appreciate it. I hope you found this helpful and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.